Mr. Speaker, sir, I join you and the House to welcome the second batch of students from Lenana School, also called Changes. These young men, once they complete school, they will be called Libons because they will have been processed through one of the finest institutions of learning in this republic. Mr. Speaker, this house has never had a shortage of Libons. As I mentioned yesterday when I welcomed the batch that was here yesterday, the former deputy speaker of this house and the current cabinet secretary for interior, uh, Professor uh, Kindiki, is a Libon, is an old boy of Lenana School. The current governor of Nairobi, who has also been the senator of Nairobi in this house, is a Changerian or a Libon. Mr. Speaker, yours truly is a Libon who was in James House in Block 5. And uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, Block 5 used to be a bit close to Riruta. So our uh, hobby in the evenings was to go and grab some mutura from Riruta. But I am not encouraging the boys to do so because if they do those kind of activities, they will end up becoming politicians like me and they will come to this house. Mr. Speaker, I want to encourage the Libons uh, that are in the gallery through you that I hope that amongst them, I will get my lawyer in future. I hope that amongst them, I will get my doctor in future. Because Mr. Speaker, I don't trust the doctors in this house to treat me, particularly Dr. Senator, uh, the, whip, the, the, the Senator for Kakamega. I cannot trust him with an injection. And so, okay. Mr. Speaker. Senator, Senator Kajuang, you're out of order. I'm totally out of order. You will not discuss the conduct of uh, the, the Senator for Kakamega. At least, if he could be here to, to give Same his, himself. to defend himself, it would be better. But you don't want to attack him because he's not around. So please desist from that. Actually, we withdraw that statement that you can't trust him. You, okay. you are on a national TV. Mr. Speaker, with a lot of respect, I withdraw. I, I've spent the entire morning sitting next to the bullfighter, so I, I think he has infected me in a way. But I hope, <laughs> I hope that uh, the batch that is here will be our doctors in future, our lawyers, our engineers, our software engineers. They'll be the ones providing solutions to the challenges that this continent and this globe faces as far as climate change is concerned. They'll be the team that will take us to the metaverse. They'll be the team that will carry Elon Musk's ambition and the ambitions of other billionaires that, that there could be life outside this planet and that we can explore and humanity can master the universe. Mr. Speaker, I want to encourage the boys from Lenana. The reason why it is called changes. It changes people. They come in as villagers. But after four years, they are refined gentlemen. I want to encourage them to change from villagers, not to think of themselves as Luos, Kikuyus, Kambas, because this is a national school that admits boys from all corners of the country, that after four years, let them see themselves as Kenyans. And Mr. Speaker, I cannot fail to say this. Lenana is a school that has produced men, real men, not those other men who toss uh, up and down, real men. And that is why Lenana was the best school when it came to rugby, Mr. Speaker, until the schools from Western Kenya uh, came along. And because of the diet that they are fed on, the schools in Western Kenya, they are eating cassavas and yams and uh, such uh, uh, starchy things for breakfast, while at Lenana, they are eating uh, Yorkshire pudding and uh, such exotic things. That is the reason why rugby moved from Lenana school, from St. Mary's school, from Nairobi school, I went to Musingu, where Sifuna went, and went to a few other miscellaneous schools in Western Kenya on account of the diet that they undertake. Mr. Speaker, I finalize, I finalize by marveling that in this house, in this parliament, Mr. Speaker, I am yet to, I, I have met alumni of very great schools, Alliance, Stare, I've, I've, I've met uh, Bomerians, I've, I've met, uh, I've met uh, people from Cotet. I've met people from all the choice schools, even people from Yale, like Senator Eddie Okech. I am yet to meet in the corridors of parliament, even though I meet a lot of them in the corridors of county assemblies. I am yet to meet someone from Nairobi School who has made it to parliament, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, Nairobi School is our perennial rival. 
and on that account, there have been more senators, MPs, cabinet secretaries from Lenana School as compared to those from Nairobi School. Mr. Speaker, I welcome the boys and wish them success in the upcoming exams. Thank you, Mr.